All right. Uh, let's do something different. Let's take the underground. It's actually, I'm going to take the animate dead. Maybe wheel Reggie. Do something a little different. I don't normally like reanimator, but hello, nurse. Immediately rewarded. Inquisition, buried alive, flats. We should be able to wield this. I'm going to take the Inquisition. In fact, this also wheels the majority of the time. Good start. No, I don't think we need the fetch. What happened? Is this a meme? Or is this actuality here? <gasps> What is happening again? See, this is a trap. What normally happens is you sit here for a while and you're like, oh my gosh, should I restart the client? But no, that's the trick. You don't want to restart the client. If you restart the client, that's how they get you. If you restart, then it's going to take an eternity to reload and you're going to miss picks that way. So you sit and you wait. But then you sit a while, and then you're like, wait a minute, maybe my client has crashed. Maybe I should restart. But then that's the double debate, and no, you just sit through it. You just wait. Just have to have patience. There are some fine cards here, but nothing that really tickles the pickle. Brazen's okay, Massacre's okay, Fauna, Coligons, Riftwing, all okay. I did, I jump started once yesterday. 2 0, quit. Yeah, I'm okay taking Coligons. This almost always wheels. You can always target yourself with Coligons. Ulamog <clears throat> Ulamog's not a bad reanimate target. If we want to take that, could also just take the Imperial Seal. Tutor effects always a welcome addition. We got like Seal a little bit more. Ulamog, again, is a fine reanimate target, but there are others. Case in point here Rider, Shouldred, could take Bitter Blossom. I think I like Ash and Rider a little bit more than the Shouldred. I've actually not been super impressed with Shouldred. I like things that have abilities immediately when they enter, which is why um, Ulamog is like fine, but not amazing. Hmm, that's not true. I mean, one attack is probably good enough, but. How much does Vintage Cube cost? 10 tickets, 100 play points, $10. I think Unburial Rites is like the worst reanimate spell in the cube. I already have two better ones. I think I might actually take Vista here. If I didn't already have two good reanimate spells, maybe I consider the Unburial Rites, but I think the land is what I want. All right, we did wheel. Excuse me, hiccups. We did wield the Reggie, so that's good. Hmm. Elishnorn is, again, not a very good reanimate target in my experience slash opinion. Elishnorn's fine versus, like, the creature-based decks, but... I think I would rather just have the throat here. Well, we're planning on wheeling the Massacre Worm, aren't we? Aren't we? <laughs> Pretty good first pack. <sighs> Rockus is okay. More so if I picked up like sneak attack or something. Are you happy now? Man. Why? <laughs> Just why, Ink Eyes? Why? 
Nobody has ever played Ink Eyes in the history of Vintage Cube. Ever. Okay, Shallow Grave means we can do some, uh, some potential, like, Eldrazi nonsense, if we want to. Time Twister's pretty juicy as well, if we want that. I think Shallow Grave can probably wheel, given we've cut it off. Yeah, I'm okay to take this. Oh, abandon everything. Actually, you can still run value Yogmoth's will in uh, Reanimator. It's not crazy. But... I might just take, like, Cabal Ritual here, or Chalice. Eh, I think I like the fast mana. If that was Dark Ritual, I'd be a lot more intrigued, but... Oh! Could have had the Yogmas Will and LED, but Mystical Tutor's good here. Mystical Tutor's real good. How are we crewing our copter? Treachery, perhaps? Treachery's pretty busted. Search for his Kanta is okay. Shriek Ma's okay. Signet's okay. Crew it with the Massacre Worm. I don't even think we start Massacre Worm or Shuldred. Ideally, I sideboard those two and just bring them in if necessary. Well, there's good old Reanimate. Don't like passing Preordain, but... Now we have... I think the two best reanimate spells, just reanimate and animate dead, and necromancy might be better than exhume. Kenji, the name of the deck is reanimate. Of course it is the best. Hmm. What are the best reanimate targets we can still get? Grizzlebrand. Um, Primus or Terastodon are okay. Iona. Well, the problem, with the, the problem with Animate Dead is that they can interact if they have enchantment removal, which does come up quite often. Uh, yeah, we'll take the Fiend over the Wasteland. I think I would take Strip Mine over Fiend, but Fiend over Wasteland is good. Alright, well, never passed a Watery Grave in my life. We could probably run Hypnotic Spectre if we really wanted to. Okay, you cannot reanimate Progenitus. Makeshift Mannequin is okay. Angel of Serenity is not terrible, but I don't think we need to take this. I think I'd rather just have the Mannequin. Okay, there's the Grave on the wheel. Leaves us out to potentially getting some uh, juicy Eldrazi in the last pack. <clears throat> Dismembers. Fine. <laughs> I mean, Ashen Rider is a decent target. Ah, uh, I think Field of Ruin, pretty bad. Well, th because this is just like if you're reanimating, I'm not running a bunch of small creatures, right? The idea is to get a bunch of ways to cheat in um, oppressive large creatures. Especially with the start I already had, you know? Like, look at Smuggler's Copter in this deck. At least in the reanimate decks that I have, I don't want to be drafting a bunch of small creatures. This is fine to run if we want to. Alright, I mean, we have enough playables already, and this is just the end of pack two, so... Channel! <laughs> uh, what do we got here? Baleful Strix and Pack Rat, huh? Eh, I hate Pack Rat. Obviously, it's a good card. I just hate the card. Ooh, a Mind Twist. Speaking of cards I hate, I hate Mind Twist. 
There have been plenty of drafts where I have passed Mind Twist just because I don't like it. But, I mean... Thought Seize, Days, Signet, Time Spiral, good pack. Do I have to take Stinky Sphinx here? I guess I do. Yeah, maybe. Maybe there's merit to taking C's over the twist. I think the only mana rocks I would really want here are like Chrome Mox, Mox Diamond, or any of the Moxen. Still looking for like Grizzle Daddy or Eldrazi. I'm not super confident in this deck right now. Shallow Graves, not good enough yet. Okay, okay, okay. Terastodon's also a fine hit. Well, it's probably safest to take Terastodon here. Because then I don't have to rely on Shallow Grave. Yeah, I think this is probably safer. We don't need the Shallow Grave. We'd rather just do the regular reanimating. It's fine. Would I have taken Demir's Signet over Thoughtseize? I don't think so. Bone Shredder? Alencron? Ugh. Weak. Weak! Oh, okay. Lily's really, really good. <clears throat> Excuse me. No, I think we want Lily more than Faithless. Also, Faithless is a red card here. Watch me lose to Ink Eyes. That would be fitting. Okay, there's another instant speed reanimate effect. Um, I think we might just want to take Languish here instead, though. Damn. Damn, bro. Dang it. I don't think we need Liliana. We have enough ways to reanimate. Ashiok is just another one of those cards that can win single-handedly. Yeah, the double blue on Treachery is kind of a stretch, I agree. Oh, Lightning Greaves might not be terrible here, too. Sideboard Hawk over Sword. Yeah, I think I like... Cutting the Massacre Worm from the main. I don't mind starting these four. Shouldred is my least favorite of all these, but I think it's okay. I can probably cut Shriek Maw. Since we picked up the Languish. Mm. Yeah, the deck is okay. It started off nice. And kind of fizzled out. Uh, I think Sphinx is better. Eh, last pick. Leovold! Question is, am I running 16 lands or 17? Probably okay to run 16. Splash Leovold. We got the Quagmire. Okay. We have Pack Rat, we have Rotting Registrar, we have Liliana. Those are all ways to put a card from our hand into the graveyard. Blech. <laughs> In a sense, this is Sultai Poop, yes. I guess I can pretty easily run four islands. Thanks, I hate it. God, the Shrine for Sphinx Hardcast. I guess that's technically something I could do. It's too late. And I'm probably never going to uh, change it. <sighs> Alright, well. It's got Ashiok, I guess I keep. Mystical Tutor can find any, uh, oh, Jesus, we're dead! We're already dead! I kind of want to go grab, like, Inquisition here. I 
Well, I guess I'm going to go get Cabal Ritual next turn. Maybe they just play a Mana Dork and we get him. Play some stupid Mana Dork. Play two Mana Dorks. This is the saddest play I've ever made in my life. I've made many sad plays. In before they play two Mana Dorks next turn. Stop it! <laughs> Stop! I mean, I guess. Well, I guess I should consider myself fortunate they didn't have a way to uh, channel me. Oh, man. <laughs> I mean... I think I just have to fire it off. Ashiocking first doesn't do anything. <sighs> this is my only... This is my only shot here. But I can't even... I can't even reanimate it next turn without uh, drawing something. Uh, wait, they had lethal on board! Alright, that works. I can li Lily Manigan? Guys, or Lily Mannequin? Count the manas. Come on, chat. Oh, I see what you mean. Protection doesn't work here? I mean, it does. Like, it's got first strike, so... Eh, alright. Alright, they just redrew nature's claim. So Dismember can come in, Shriek Maw can come in. I don't think we need Terastodon here. Eh, if we were on the draw, that also would ha would have helped quite a bit. The double blue on Treachery, I think, is too much of a stretch. Yeah, I can cut the Lightning Greaves, too. That's fine. Yep, I think we do want this. Could cut the blue. I don't think I want to, though. I don't know. If I'm bringing in a lot of removal, then the Living Death gets worse, right? I bring in a ton of removal and then go like spend the first few turns re using removal spells and then living death. That's awkward. Worm of over Shouldred. I don't. They didn't play any mana dorks. I mean, I guess they. I'm sure they do have some, but nah. Nighthawks filler. I guess I probably don't need makeshift mannequin. Uh. Well, I guess Animate Dead and Necromancy are both bad versus their uh, nature's claim. Hmm. You know what? I'm going to run 41 cards because I can't decide what I want to do. Exactly. Hmm, good legacy cube hand. I'm excited to lose to a channel. Always dismember the land or the. Always dismember the Elves of Deep Shadow. You know the common phrase. Always Liliana minus two, the Elvish Mystic. You guys know the common phrase. <laughs> uh, I guess I'm going to pitch the mannequin here. It only reanimates my graveyards. My graveyard, I should say. Impulse, Channel, Finale. Alright, so they have... Ch or sorry, not Channel. They have Forest, Impulse, Finale, but they have Channel, Finale for later. Ooh, 
QB, Trigon, land. Discard the Languish now. Mind Twist for three. <laughs> Ooze, Cloudskate, Ulamog. Oh, the perfect combo again! They had channel Ulamog in their hand. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. I don't even need to attack. I just need to make you regret living. <sighs> um, maybe I do cut the time twister. Yeah, fine, chat. Shut up. Leave me alone. Still running 41 because it worked out last time. I'm a big old baby. All right, well, the hope is that I draw a fatty off the top and then just discard it immediately. <sighs> we can always reanimate one of their creatures as well, should we kill it. Please, no channeling. Go for the Fiend here, I guess. Ooh. I mean, at this point, Inquisition's not likely to do much, and Fiend can hit some scary cards still. Yeah, Harmonize, nice. I mean, if they draw Channel, they got me good. <laughs> so I guess we hope they don't draw Channel. Oh, they drew a questing beast. Okay. Um, so we're gonna go for the throat that and then reanimate it. It's like a fine play. Last card in their hand is just Ulamog. Oops. Annoying, but fine. It doesn't block the questing beast. One more hit with questing beast and channel Ulamog is almost out of the picture, right? I'm gonna... No, I can take the hit. Well... Yeah. Alright, if they don't play anything post-combat, I will kill it. Nice. That's actually really good. I think I necromancy their uh, slime and kill their island now. Take a peek at what's in their hand. Nature's claim! Yeah! Necromancy's live again! Woo, 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 woo. Now they can't even channel Emrakul, or they can't even channel uh, whatever it's called, Ulamog, they don't have enough life. <sighs> All right. See, my cards weren't good enough. I needed to win with the opponent's cards. <laughs> Oh, uh, we'll take that. Definitely take it. Eh, it's dirtly, but it's a keep. And then if I draw reanimate, or maybe even animate dead off the top, I'll probably pitch to hand size, turn one. Mulligan to five. Alright, I'm probably gonna draw time twister. Hey, wait a minute. What the heck? What kind of hand is this? Stop! At least we have a clock, I guess. <laughs> uh, lose, 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 lose. Yeah! Yeah. 
Hey, I'm not dead yet. Pretty good mulligan to five, though. Yeah, they lost again! Yeah, we're not D-E-A-D -E dead, we're just D-E-D -E dead. Big difference, chat. Big ol' difference. What the hell, you got an ice? Actually, it's better that they're icing this turn than next. Ooh, that's interesting too. Pretty toppity. No, they won a flip. In before Armageddon. Go, 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 equip, no effects. Yes! <laughs> Easy clap them. Easy clap them. You have to peel or animate dead or something? Off. Off and brick. I think I give them this versus everything. I mean, I, if they have, like, through the breach, I lose anyway, so it doesn't matter. But this is the only card that's relevant. But if they have through the breach, it doesn't matter how I order. Yeah, see? Exactly. <laughs> they took the thirst for knowledge. Good, good. Lose the flip. Die, do, shoal, dread. Yeah! Alright. Big money, no whammy. Big money, baby! Alright, so I think we br bring in Go for the Throat for all of their artifact creatures. Ooh, and Bone Shredder for all of their artifact creatures. Wow, and Shriek Maw. Holy crap, we get so many good cards versus all of their artifact creatures. Jesus. I'm actually debating Treachery, even though the double blue is pretty hard. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. The Treachery is actually kind of insane. Like, Languish seems like it's a cut. All right, so we definitely want all three of these. Yeah, I'll just bring in the treachery, cut the languish. I don't know if I need to bring in another blue source or two, but well, it's very close. For real, it's close. Ooh, it's pretty good. Uh, what am I pitching here? I guess it might actually be Mind Twist. Yeah, I think I'm pitching the twist. Not the tutor, you're crazy, bro. What? Chat, you know this gets in Tomb, right? This deck is kind of bad. Oh, they mulligan to five. Oh, man. With a mulligan to five... No, I think it's better to keep Lily. Lily is also discard. But, if they have the Tinker for Colossus, we have a way to, uh, make them sack. Oh god, OP no! <laughs> Alright, their three card hand is Island Crypt Tinker. Nope. <laughs> well, Island Lotus Tinker doesn't work. How do you sack the Lotus and then tinker? I could just get Cabal Ritual and start making him discard. I'm still gonna grab the Entomb, I think. I could just give him three elephants. Uh, Shouldra doesn't really do much. Eh, I'm okay getting Ashen Rider here.
I don't need Mind Twist. We already have multiple ways to strip their hand. Eh, I'm not even going to make him discard. It's about sending a message. Boo. Where's the fun in that play? I'd much rather do this. <laughs> Can we win another round? That's the question. Oh, it's so slow. <sighs> Maybe I draw Dark Ritual off, or uh, rather Cabal Ritual off the top for a three drop on turn two. Play a creature, I will Liliana it. Acceptable. Oh, where were you last turn, you troll? On a shaman. I think I like Cabal Ritual into Mind Twist after this, even though that means I get to kill my Lily. Just eat all of their hand. Shinobi, Gargaroth, Cobra. Overgrown Tomb. Alright, if we draw a reanimate effect, we can steal their Shinobi or their Gargaroth. Both pretty nice. I thought they were going to mind twist me back for two. <laughs> oh, the Scoos! Hey, now wait just a gosh darn second here. You cheater. One, two, three, four. All right, well, I'm not gonna fire off Mystical. I could play the island and then Mystical, but I think I'm just gonna sit back for now. Because remember, they can make their ooze too big to get out of uh, my Languish. I guess they're just going to eat their own creatures. Yeah. <sighs> yeah, I don't actually know what I'm supposed to tutor for. I guess I don't. Go get Time Twister. I don't have go for the th I don't have any of the removal spells in the main. I guess I'm just going to pass here and uh, tutor for Time Twister. No, you can't tutor for Mystical since it's a creature. Imperial Seal, eh. I think I'm giving them too much time if I do that. None of these plays are ideal. Yeah, let's just twist. No guts, no glory. Okay, not bad. Not bad at all. Mm. 
<laughs> what percentage of the time am I looking at my deck? Probably quite often. What's wrong with that? Prime time. Do they have fast mana? Slime time. Um, definitely want to kill the hissing. And then I might blow up two lands here of my own. We could do that. Yeah. Hit animate dead and then two lands and then necromancy my trust on at the end of their turn. I think I want to hit their six land and their black source though. I don't mind hitting animate dead. I think I'm just going to hit two lands though. <laughs> oh, this puts it on top. Whoops. For some reason, I thought I was going to be able to discard something good to the uh, Regisaur. So maybe it is just Languish at this point. Three. Yeah, it's fine. <laughs> oh, I know what you're saying. I guess I'm going to still go ahead and run out the Murderous Rider, though. Ooh, now it's cold in here. Emily said she didn't know they made a card in my, in, in my likeness. What's up, Plastic Socks? Thank you for the 13-month resub. And Mr. Tasty, thank you for the seven months. Entirely because there were six commercials. Womp womp. I don't want to attack. If I attack, my Registrar just trades with their slime. Especially when we have a Languish on top now. Yeah, blow up my own lands and then get Languish is kind of a suspect play. Leo? I thought I was doing something else though, but... I'll never expect it now that I blew up my own lands, truthfully. Yeah, it was the perfect bait. Uh, see, I always go by... Um, play first, think later. Intuition. Again, I don't want to attack first because they have a slime. The slime would trade away with any of my fat creatures. Alright, let's bring in the Greaves. Or sorry, not the Greaves. The Throat. Take out the Greaves. Bring in the Shredder. Bring in the Dismember. And maybe even bring in the Shrieky and the Massacre. I think Terastodon is probably worse here than Massacre. What else can I cut? Manakino. Twister. And 41. One game away from 3-0. Oh. Alright, it's got turn one interaction, turn two interaction, and turn three interaction for creatures, so. Keep. Those are not creatures, OP. I think my turn one was a lot worse than theirs. Alright, you know what? You need to calm down. Ooh, that mills me. I feel like my turns have been a little bit less 
impressive than theirs have. Yeah. Oh my god. Instant speed stone rain! I guess sinkhole is more fitting, yeah. No, what? I wonder if they activate Quag and then equip it. Meh. Meh, meh, meh is what I have to say to that. Meh. They milled my Necromancy and Reanimate. Yikes. I think I'm gonna shred their wolf. And then hold up Dismember for uh, their Quag. The only problem is now if they jam Prime Time, I don't have a way to kill it, so. But I think Prime Time was the only creature that we saw that we wouldn't be able to kill. Okay. Well, they are Hellbent. Or Shredder. Big oofs all around. I'm gonna go ahead and pay um, four life here so I can keep one of my lands untapped. <laughs> uh. Well, three more draws and I can discard a fatty. Oh no, what do they draw now? No, they only had one card in their hand. I don't think it was worth fiending. God, I, did, I don't even have any good reanimate targets in my graveyard. Alright, I guess we're dead. Alright, they did not hit the animate dead. So that's what we gotta hope to draw. Animate dead. Animate dead on Shouldred. Darn. Alright, well, we jam the worm and hope, I guess. I only have six cards left in my deck, though. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Just need him to brick on a few more turns of spells. I said brick on a few more turns of spells. Dang it. Alright, well their their opening hand was pretty solid. I wonder if hippies worth bringing in versus them. Well, the unlucky thing was Maybe not unlucky, but the unfortunate thing is that I didn't have a reanimate spell in my hand for when they did mill me. No, because remember, I brought in all that spot removal, so I don't want to have a bunch of spot removal on their early plays and then living death after. Ah! Close! Very close. I mean, not going to get much better than this uh, six, I guess. Tomb into reanimate, turn two. What do you mean, no? This hand's amazing. Question is, what am I reanimating? Like, I wonder if Sphinx of the Steel Wind just beats them? Or if I want to get Shouldred? You guys like Shouldred? Okay. I think Shouldred's okay. We also have Animate Dead. If they do kill this. In fact. I guess I'd rather animate dead this turn. I mean they can kill. Shoulder with the trigger on the stack. But they're going to still have to sacrifice. Turn two shoulder. 
Mr. Steve. Hmm. All right, in case we hit Green Sun, I guess. Pack Rat doesn't do much right now anyways. Look what they have in their hand there, a little slimy boy. So they get to slime me next turn, and then they, uh, then I just reanimate, I guess. Sacky Sacky. Pretty darn good mulligan to six. Yo, Ringo Derber, thank you for the nine months. Ooh, 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 ooh. The old green sun look at my library and concede. Wow, we beat the lucky dragon and luck itself. My gosh. Give me my chest. Give me my ramen app, Hydra.